powers of products and quotients. For any non-zero numbers, for any non-zero numbers like A or B, A and B, these are non-zero numbers or any integers like X, any integers like X, the, the rule is this. A, B to the power of X, you can just write it A to the power of X times B to the power of X. So for any non-zero numbers, so these, sh these two should be zero numbers, and X is integer. So is a b to the power of x, you can write a to the power of x and b to the power of x. And we also have the rule a over b, for example, to the power of c, you can write it a to the power of c over b to the power of c. So a to the power of c and b over b to the power of c. Let's take a look at some examples here. 5 to the power of 3. The, uh, the rule is that here, if you have uh, a to the power of uh, to the power of uh, b, or let's just say we have x, x to the power of uh, a and the whole thing to the power of uh, b equals to x to the power of a b. So this is the powers of powers, powers of products. So we multiply these two. A, x to the power of A, the whole thing to the power of B equals to x to the power of AB. Multiply them. So for this example, it's 5, 3 times 3 is 9. So it is to the power of 9. It's not 3 plus 3. You need to multiply it. So you need to find the product of these two. This one is 4 to the power of 2 times 3 is 6. This one, when you multiply these two first, this is the power of 1. 3 to the power of 1 times 3 squared is just 3 cubed. And it is to the power of 5 equals to 5 times 3 is 15. So it is 3 to the power of 15. Next one here. 5x to the power of 5, y to the power of 6. The whole thing to the power of 5. So start from the number 5 to the power of 5, x to the power of 5 to the power of 5, so it's 5 times 5, it is x to the power of 25. And y to the power of 6, 6 times 5 is 30, it's y to the power of 30. Next one, 4x is actually here, multiplication, times 5y cubed. So first, multiply these two. It's 4 times 5 because they're different numbers. So we cannot use the exponent rules. 4 times 5 is 20. So it is 20x and y cubed to the power of 2. The next step, 20 to the power of 2, x to the power of 2, and y cubed to the power of 2 means that 2 times 3 is 6. is to the power of y to the power of 6. Next one here, we have x, we have 6x over x cubed to the power of 2. So we know that for division rules, you need to subtract the powers. So inside the parentheses is actually 6x to the power of 1 minus 3. Why? Because it's, here is 1, the power is 1, 1 minus 3, the whole thing. Or if you bring this x up, it becomes negative 3. So 1 minus 3 is negative 2. So it is 2 to the power of 2 equals to x to the power of 2. Is 6 to the power of 2 is 36. And x to the power of negative 2. 1 minus 3 is negative 2 or minus 2. To times 2 is negative 4. So 36x to the power of negative 4. Next one here. So we can cancel some values here. It's x5 and that one is x3. So 5 minus 3 is 2. So it is x to the power of, or x squared, x to the power of 2. y is 5 minus 3 is just y squared to the power of 3. So 
Now we need to multiply powers of product. 2 times 3 is 6, so it's x to the power of 6 times y to the power of 6, or x6, y6. This one is negative 3. We want to make it positive first, so flip everything. So inside this parenthesis, if you bring this one up, it becomes 4xy cubed, and this one goes down, it's xy5 to the power of 3, positive 3. So if, flip, if you flip numerator and denominator, the sign of the power changes. It was negative, now it is positive. Equals to. Now here we can cancel some values, x and x. Here you can cancel it. Cancel these two. So x just removed. And y here is to the power of 3. And that was the denominator is to the power of 5. So 3 minus 5 is negative 2. So it is 4y negative 2 to the power of 3. Now if you multiply the powers, 4 to the power of 3 is 4 times 4 times 4, which is 64. And y to the power of negative 6. You can write it also 64 over y to the 6. Why? Because y, if you put it if you put it in the denominator part, it becomes positive. The power becomes positive. So the answer, the final answer is 64 over y to the 6.